Hey y'all, welcome back to another video where today I'm going to be showing you the tiny house ball because if you guys didn't watch my last video, which was last night, um, it was what, um, well, what I'm going to be doing now. And also I said that I'm going to um, start making, my dad and I are going to talk if I can make a tiny house, a new one, which will be a double story. So I'll have a loft and then your, your normal room. So I'm going to just give you a tour of this house. Um, Sorry if it's if it's very dirty because of um yesterday. It was just howling. We went to we went to Friday Island, my whole family and my grandma. <coughs> we all went to um have um lunch there. It was just howling. We literally had to go outside and rescue some people, so it was just very windy. A cat actually was flying over there. That's how strong the wind was. So yeah, um Lesson learned, be safe. So, it's very dusty in here. I mean, I was amazed when I, I just came in here and I was like, oh, frick. I need a really clean up. Sorry if my hair's sticking up. Frick, uh, dude. So, here it is. I'm so sorry, guys. I don't think you can see the dust, but actually, no, you can. You can. Look how dusty the bed is. Oh. Wait, underneath, is it actually still okay? Oh, thank God. Thank you. Thank gosh. Oh, if that wasn't like that, oh. It's a good thing I didn't put the fridge, because this is like the fridge stand. So, yeah. Um. What should I do? Should I do the inside? Yeah, I'm going to do the inside so them. I mean, the outside. <clears throat> okay, guys. So, um. I'm going to do the front, back, and then the um, two sides. So first, the front, um, this is treated wood. So this is nice, proper treated wood. And we use decking screws all around over here. Then um, this is the stuff over here. It's shake cloth. So this is basically like plastic. Come on. Can't really see it so well. So guys, this is basically... This is basically plastic. Yeah. Basically plastic, but um, except we did a double layer. Just so here's the one layer. Here's the um, second layer. Just for a bit of you know, if it is, if I ever sleep in here, which I probably won't, but I'm giving this to my brother so he can maybe, you know, do stuff. Cause my brother's only six, but he likes building stuff also. So I'm gonna give it to my brother, but. I'm just giving a tour now what I did. Everything's going to come out of, to my house probably. Or I might just keep it here. So, yeah. But all the cool stuff here, over here, definitely taking it. So, oh no, it's going to get windy again. And it's going to rain again. It's just now was such a nice day. And now it was like this. Seriously. Well, I'm going to have to film in the cold. So, yeah, double layer. Um, this is the door over here, guys. We wanted, we didn't want to put, like, a proper door in. And then over here are some holes. Just over here. Just so that there's, you, I think, no, wait, you guys didn't see it. There's locks in here. And then you just lock it in there. And then this is, like, a big um, sliding um, window. But except it doesn't, like, slide. It doesn't go that way. It goes up. So then we have these two brass ones, one over there, over there, and then one over here. Got the, we, we use the simple X-frame, as you can see, simple X-frame. This is the fridge stand. Um, I didn't really put the fridge in here because I'm scared if it will rain again. And that fridge, I bought that fridge, guys. It costs like 6,000 rand or something like that, so I didn't really want to risk it. And that's going to go in the tiny house that will probably be somewhere over there i don't know um so yeah that's where it's gonna go and then it can stay there forever so and the, then we have a patio over here and we also have a mat just to make it a bit more homey or some of that and over here on this side we have all the wood stuff like that um this is treated wood over here i actually treated it but yeah i don't think it dried this is also double layer shade cloth all around is actually double layer shade cloth, and we just use some um, decking screws. And I don't know what these called, but we used um, only 
three six on this side and these are this is like my plant growth thing um i, I put vegetables and stuff like that and i think two fruit in here now over here um i put a gate my mom put a gate over here because um the um our younger dog lena which is akila's half sister same same father different mother so this is the watering tank so lena just can't dig here so yeah this is the water tank and this is where I get my water from. I think it's raining. I don't know. It's where I get my water from. Um, yeah, this is the. This is. I think this is. I'm just gonna call it the valve. Uh, then the, is the is the pipe, and it just runs in in here. And then over here we, we have wood over here that just keep um, because I cut a hole in the shade cloth so that the hole doesn't um, expand and get bigger and then. Um, it will actually probably break. So then over here we have the, this is just a simple stem. Um, this thing is, I think, four meters um, long. So I dug a hole so this can go in here. It's actually very secure. Um, I sat on it and my brother and it's very secure. Um, then over here we have the water tank and this is the roof. We use three layers of it. So yeah. And then over here, if we come to this side, we have more of these. And double layer shade cloth again, more of these. This is like my backyard basically. And then more of these. One well, double layer and uh, and another gate, but you can't really open that one, so yeah. I think that's enough with the outside tour. It's not much at the outside, but there's a there's a lot in the inside, so let's make our way over there. Okay. So first of all the fridge stand, um, I think you guys already saw this, uh, so the fridge goes over there, this is the mattress goes, it's a blow-up mattress, um, luckily it didn't blow away, um, I'm sorry guys, everything's so dusty, um, I'll quickly take this, this is a sheet, luckily we put the sheet on, uh, so it's all clean underneath, so it doesn't really matter if this sheet gets dirty, look at it, it's so Literally, it's so dirty that that's where the line is. That's where it goes. Gosh. Oh, man, my freaking legend. Wow. Well, at least one spot's clean. And another. And another. And another. Okay. So that already helps. Good. Um. Oh, these are fairy lights. So I don't know if you guys can see it. But see off. And then. Uh, you can't see it. So we have two fairy lights. Here's the bedside table. This is decking wood. There I use. Another X frame over here. And another one over there. We all use, we, um, on every side we use the X frame. Then um, over here, this is the fairy light so that you can, you know, sleep and stuff like that. Good thing I didn't sleep there, like, last night. So if I did, it would be terror. So then, guys, over here, when you come here, you go to the kitchen. Um, let me first get this thing. Sorry, guys, I'm just going to quickly clean the kitchen up, so, yeah. Okay, guys, so when we go over here, this is the kitchen. So first we have the um, spatula and the frying pan. I'm going to move um, everything over here. I'm going to move it to the townhouse. Wait, what happened to my cooking pan thing? Um, then we have storage underneath. This probably will come, um, this table, this kitchen um, countertop will probably come with me. Maybe not, maybe so. I'll probably give it to my brother also. It's because you can't really build things like this. I mean, <coughs> I'll probably give him everything here except for like, you know, not everything like this will definitely come with me. The fairy lights, oh yeah. Um... Maybe all the basic stuff. This will come with me. The mattress can stay here because I need to buy my own mattress for the upstairs. Okay, at least the clothes stayed right. That's good. Then. Um, so then over here, guys, we have just a bowl, a mixing bowl. Um, we are busy mixing sand in here, so that's quite nice. We've got storage underneath. So over here, we have our cinnamon and sugar. Got our cocoa mix, and also behind there, we got our um, chamomile and rooibos. Um, up on top here, we also got our cutlery, so our silverware, um, lip balm for me, 
Then over here we have our traditional syrup, some coasters, then over here another fairy light, salt and sugar. Then over here we have our sink, a um, attachment, and then up there is the um like the thing that we use so in the sun sunlight liquid. And then there's the attachment so you can attachment attach it on on there and you can just use it to clean dishes. Um over here's the wood. That was, that's what I was talking about at the other side. Um this is just to keep the hole so if if it if it does expand or something like that, at least we have a bit of support. I don't even think that will help because I only put four screws in there and currently one of them have disappeared. So I don't know. Then over here we have our water. It's a bit tight. But just, so that's our water. That goes from the tank to here. Um, two cloths. These stayed. These current. These actually don't have any sand in them. Huh, that's nice. And then at the bottom, um, oh yeah, also over here we have some cup hangers. I made these um, holders out of because I love, I kind of like um, crocheting. And over here, this is where your food is. So I only got four eggs left. Um, got four plates. See, this this stuff over here will come with me. The glass definitely, because my brother can't handle that. Flapjack mix, marshmallows, and a bit of sweets. This is a kettle over here. And then over here is the um, the cooker. Here, here we have a bigger frying pan. What? What's a killer doing? What's she doing? Um. And your sink. That stuff, bedside table. This is like a cushion so you can sit on it. And gosh, everything's so dirty. I hate it. There's no point of cleaning this whole place because just it's gonna get dirty anyway again, I think. So yeah, sitting table. This I varnished. This is actually from an old palette. Now guys, don't just throw away palettes. If you want, please give it to me guys. Um I do have a phone number, I will put it up. I'll put it on um, on the video. I'll probably put it in the in the description. I'll put my phone number there. Please just phone me and then um, uh, please give me a pilot or um, wood or something like that, like you know pine or plywood or whatever you really have, but at least decent sizes, you know. So yeah. So this is a table. I mean, you guys can see it quite nicely. Now me, I'm just looking at it. Like, what? So yeah, this is the bit, um, this is the table, dining room table. I um, varnished it on the top. It's double layer, and then over here at the bottom, um, it's proper one layer. And then just a quick swipe for a second layer. As you can see on here, it's quite bright, and then over here it's like a bit darker. So yeah, um, this is a uh, thick plywood over here, and then I just use um, um, mini decking screws, which are these. Um, Other than that, this, for this tiny house, um, there's not really windows or circulation for this stuff. I mean, you open that big over here, you just open this big thing over here, and then you have a big breeze coming in. So, yeah. Um, I attached on this side, you can see here's actually storage on all of those. Um, I kept this one open so that circulation can come through. And then... Over here, um, I just left a tiny gap for all of them. As you can see, a tiny gap, and then another tiny gap. So, from that, that's really all. I mean, yeah, not much. I mean, I, it looks actually very terrible. I had to put everything in because the moment it drizzled, I just knew, uh-oh, it's rain. It's just gonna be rain. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you do, make sure you leave a like, subscribe, it's a red button, and then once you hit that red button, um, hit the notification bell, and then also put the comment section down below, I subscribe. 
and I will um, heart your comment and I'll reply back to you. So, yeah, that's all. Sorry, guys, if it was boring, but yeah, one more look of the tiny house. Okay, guys, that's all. Peace.